This is a Game Caviar production. Not having it playing some uh, Modern Warfare 3. Now, I was going to say some old school Call of Duty, but it's really not that old, to be honest with you. But it is not the newest Call of Duty game, of course. But since I'm on my Xbox, I decided to play it. And while I did have some times in this match where I was really uh, raging, uh, it really wasn't that bad. Uh, I mean, the game itself is not really as bad as it was. So uh, it's more playable now. But the thing that you always will have to worry about in Call of Duty is the, uh, are the campers and the snipers. You know, quick scoping still exists in this game. And I think that's something that will always be in a Call of Duty game. So uh, let's. Uh, that's not what I want to talk about in this video. Let's look at the list of games that are coming up this month in March. And let's see what type of games are you guys going to get. Now, let's see. Uh, I'm just looking at the games. The MLB, MLB 13 and Major League Baseball 2K13 are coming out for baseball fans. Uh, SimCity is coming out on PC. That's a very good game. I played the beta and it's awesome. Uh, let's see here. A Tomb Raider. Really big game. Uh, I saw some early reviews on that game and it was really, really positive. So I'm guessing that Tomb Raider is going to be a really good game. I haven't really heard that many people talking about it, but... It looks like it's going to be maybe a sleeper, man. Be honest with you. Uh, if you're going to get any of these games, please uh, go ahead. Feel free to list them in the, the uh, what is it, in the description. I mean, not the description, in the comment section. And we could chit-chat about it. <clears throat> and I'll put this list in the description so everybody can look at it. Let's see here. Uh, March 12th. Uh, sniper. This is where everybody who plays Sniper in Call of Duty should buy this game called Sniper. Just for people who like to play as snipers. God of War Ascension, PS3, exclusive. I played that beta. That game is really fun. I'm not really that big of a, a uh, God of War fan, but that game was really fun. Online was... Uh, I had fun online. It was pretty cool. Uh, let's see, Dog Stalkers Re Resurrection. I don't know what that's about. I haven't heard anything. Let's see, March 18th. This is a Wii U game, but it's going to be pretty cool, especially if you have kids or if you like Lego games. <clears throat> but Lego City Undercover is basically like Grand Theft Auto, but a kid's version of it, if you can imagine that, in your Lego and a Lego universe. I saw a video before the Wii U came out. I uh, showed it to my kids. They were all excited about it. I was like, man, this game looks pretty cool, so I'll probably pick it up. I most likely will. Uh, I don't think that I'm going to end up doing a video on it, but uh, that would involve me moving the Wii U from where it is to the Game Caviar Studios. And, you know, it's just more work than it has to be. Uh, let's see. March 19th, God of War Judgment. And uh, Need for Speed, uh, most wanted on the Wii U, uh, you know. But God of War Judgment, I mean, not God of War, Gears of War. Judgment. Uh, people are like, God of War Judgment? Is two God of War games? No, it's Gears of War Judgment. That's coming out on the 360 exclusively. And it's the prequel to Gears of War 1, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, probably just the prequel to Gears of War 1. And uh, I have it pre-ordered. And so I'm going to get it. You can expect to see videos of it. Of course, it's going to be on the channel. It's going to be featured because Game Caviar has been known to feature the newest... And hottest games on this channel. That's what this is all about. So I'm going to be doing a review of that game. And uh, I'm going to let you guys know my uh, pros and cons of it. But uh, let's move on. I know some people are kind of pissed off about it. Because they're changing some things in the game. But overall it looks like it's going to be a very good game. Uh, what do we have here? Where am I at? Uh, March 22nd, Dead or Alive 5 Plus for PlayStation Vita. Resident Evil 6 on PC. Hmm, there must be something to keep keep an eye on if you're a PC gamer. Uh, March 24th, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, Gates to Infinity 3DS. Uh, <laughs> if you're a Pokemon player, I mean, that's, that's probably a big thing. That's probably a big deal, that in Luigi's Mansion. Uh, March 26th. Army of Two, The Devil's Cartel, I will be getting that game. Oh, Bioshock Infinite comes out on the same day. I did not know that. Uh-oh. Looks like I'm going to be splitting time in between the two games. But, again, 
you will see these videos, uh, videos of these games on the channel. Uh, the new Army of Two. I'm a really big Army of Two fan. I will tell you that right now. I love that game. I like how the two guys, the banter between the two of them, and how you can tell the guy to be aggressive and like go kill people, or fall back. The cover system, the, uh, the customization of the weapons, everything in that game was pretty cool. I like it, and I can't wait for the new one to come out. And uh, Bioshock Infinite, of course, you know, it's going to be awesome. But anyway, drop me a line. We'll talk about it. And uh, uh, you can expect to see videos from the, the, the hottest games on this channel. Anyway, I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. And I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.